Hey guys, welcome back to your Young Chaos community. We are going to be checking out Chapter 4, Season 4 of Fortnite Battle Royale. It's looking awesome from the leaks we put out and everything. Starting off with the trailer, there's the clips that's been hyped up for a while. The whole building's already here, which kind of doesn't make sense. Power's going out. That looks important. It has a date on top of there. Alright, this is the Collector, I'm pretty sure. It's the main, um, like, almost villain of the season. And he has a pretty cool sword. wonder if that's like a katana. Oro's head. I don't know if that means he's dead or not. Massive collection. Mythic goldfish. Everything. A bunch of data analysis. Who's who are these characters? Whoa! All the battle pass. All right. Okay. So I wonder if these are like some type of agents. Pretty cool skin right there. Those are new henchmen. Don't know who that is. It looks like a Jonesy of some sort. Probably isn't. That's a buff fish stick. I saw uh, like a Jonesy, and that's the new shield breaker item. I'm pretty sure to the leaks. It takes down the lasers or it might be this is some type of deployable turret that looks pretty powerful but of course they can definitely just be weakened um they just overhype it what is that it looks like some type of breacher all right it's gonna wreck build that's a new copy lane um a skin a new icon series wonder if it's in the whole battle pass the mythic drum gun all right i wonder if that's actually in here I wonder if you can actually fail these um, type of breaches. All the new battle pass skins, yeah, this guy's definitely the villain of some sort. He's a vampire or bat? Alright, and here's the gameplay trailer. Alright, this is my personal favorite, just seeing all the new gameplay features. And it actually looks like we're going to be able to enter these. Whoa, that is a massive POI. Enter these actual safes. That is a weird looking skin for sure. Awesome looking skins. Last resort, so that's the type of theme going on. Okay, uh, I'm seeing the dragon's breath, but in like a grenade launcher. There's a turret that we saw in the trailer. Alright, that looks pretty cool. Auto locks onto them. A new emote there. And yeah, so it's some type of breacher. That's gonna be great for mobility, I feel like. It's like a nuke of some sort. That's gonna be shocking. It's like a landmine that you can shoot. There's a shield breaker. So I, oh, it takes down the turret. I, I wonder if it does anything to actual players. New weapon scope. And maybe some type of augment on them. New cars. Those have some drifts. Um, are you in? Okay. And yeah, so that's been some type of weird vampire looking thing. Oh, and what's this? Oh, ah oh, Ahsoka. Duh. All right. I wonder if she's in the battle pass for the new show. Awesome. This is looking super crazy already going on. And we're going to be checking out the battle pass so we can claim the battle pass. I'm guessing that, um, Kedo's Throne, I believe his skin, um, uh, is called, is a tier 100. And starting off, we do have Nolan Chance. So this is the tier 1, pretty cool, it reminds me of Jonesy for some reason. And yeah, so tier 1 right there, and now going to the battle pass, we're going to start off with the 100. So yeah, this is for Nolan Chance, so we have a loading screen, 100 V-Bucks, a banner icon, backup blaze, a pretty cool dual wield one for sure. Dice roll, a rare emote, alright, pretty unique, we haven't seen a dice emote, so I wonder if it's actually going to show the results, so if it's like an actual usage, it is, that's awesome. So it's going to show you uh, what it rolls on, so I'm guessing it's going to be um, just six different uh, um, like numbers you can roll on, which is pretty cool, let's redo that, so yes, okay, we got five, so you're probably going to be able to get anywhere from one to six, pretty cool there. Luxury lockbox, a pretty clean dappling, those styles might be nice. Speed run it is an animated mode, the con 100 V-Bucks, and of course Nolan Chance that we did get. Wave 2, yeah, should be a style for the skin, so we tactical Nolan Chance, it is a loading screen. A uh, uh, spray right here, not bad. Uh, flight Risk, a pretty cool glider right there, wish you did surf on it. 100 V-Bucks, Master Plan, uh, this is a new weapon, it looks like it has a bunch of different attachments to it, like a larger magazine, because you can see the regular magazine, and then a one attached to it, we have to see what it is in game. Tactical, this is a style to the Harson tool we went over in the last page, and Tactical Nolan Chance, for sure looking a lot better already, like it. And then Piper Pace, so this is uh, a new skin, uh, pretty much the uh, second new skin. So we do have a loading screen, steal, uh, stealing wheel, pretty cool there, 100 V-Bucks. Um, Pitsicle, a uh, pretty cool emo, already has music, it is traversal. Alright, not bad, the emotes are pretty nice, I do like that dice one especially. Pizza Run, and we do have Spin It Slicer, is this a Harrison tool? Yeah, it is, okay, it reminds me of that one emo where you spin the little um, sign around, pretty nice there. And then we have Piper Pace, so this is an epic alpha. I feel like it would have went better with the Chapter 4 Season 2, the whole Mega City and all that. However, this person does seem to be like an Uber delivery driver of some sort, delivering pizza, it's asking in the trailer. 
and then we do have a new style in this page so we have hyperspace the piper face pretty cool loading screen artwork there banner icon tail lights now this is a pretty cool one i do like this one 100 v bucks hyperspace all right it's a pretty basic uh glider just a reskin and we're hungry for the chase we'll have to listen to this one later um hyperspace piper pace now that's the tongue twister this one does look really awesome if it has other styles to put on the coat and everything already looking pretty good and then page five yeah a new skin this seems to be the fish thick one that we saw in here so fish thick it is an uncommon loading screen all right shows off that new uh like breacher gun of some sort fishy flex and then coming emoticon is animated powder keg all right so this is a pretty massive baffling actually i was expecting it to be a little smaller however it's pretty nice epic baffling there 100 v bucks dumbbell driver all right this one's pretty cool it's very small which i do like don't like the massive horse and tools and flaky feast reminds me of some sort of the um unicorn the fabio sparkle mains all right uh this is fish food right yeah it is all right all right and then he flex it then we fish a thick an epic loading uh epic outfit all right maybe the styles might be better however i'm not too big of a fan of fish sticks so it's uh, kind of all right and we have a fin dictator fish stick all right this is a different style it is a loading screen for this one and fish addiction all right this is a pretty awkward looking glider 100 v bucks a another um, banner icon of okay so this is another style for the bat blink coral crush all right once again with that weird looking red dot extended magazine weapon and with fig uh fin dictator fish thick all right pretty nice there we saw this one also in the trailer page seven we do have a new outfit so we have may and then come the link screen may jr an epic baffling all right um uwu uncommon wrapping all right there's i seems to be a self-shading uh skin 100 v bucks drones uh drones e view all right kind of a weird little spray there the original bonk bunny so this one is yeah once again cell shading we've seen very similar harvesting tools in the past isn't that crazy and we made an epic outfit i believe this one was in the survey so it finally came out an epic outfit not bad maybe the styles might be a little better anyway black hey uh hat may and then come loading screen uh, 100 v bucks a race to the horizon of a music pack we'll have to listen to this one later bunny bop and then come emoticon this one is animated seems almost all the emoticons are animated now in the battle pass dark mode this is a pretty cool glider right here i it does say it's a style so did i go over it accidentally maybe not all right it says it's a style so yeah there's that and we dark mode uh epic uh, style for the baffling and we black hat mace so this one is a little better i do like the purple cell shading on it it throughout the outfit which is pretty nice page nine so i believe yeah this skin was in the one of the teasers that we got so a uh, tonia and then coming loading screen all right and we have tonia in action um allegiance blade pretty clean i do like the black and gold this is a one hand harvesting tool probably my favorite harvesting tool very clean 100 v bucks is dangerous by design it is a ring music pack I have to listen to that one later diamond drop this one's very clean i do like it it's very shiny sparkly it's not too much though and with tonia an epic outfit all right so yeah this is the one we saw in the uh, trailer all right and then the, yeah this one should be a style so we combat chick atonia uh uncommon Lid spray 100 v bucks the goods and then coming mug fun it is animated all right i like that you're kind of blowing up the safe getting the disco ball pretty cool there clutch and dagger an epic baffling pretty clean there i wonder if it is reactive to the harvesting tool because i see the harvesting tool um at the back of the baffling so maybe if you have both of them equipped you, when you pull out the harvesting tool in game it'll come off of the baffling leading in gold and then coming wrapping not bad and we crack it a rare emote all right we're gonna put that uh, all right so it's pretty much like the little emoticon and then you get the disco ball you start dancing all right it's not terrible i like that and we combat chick atonia an epic um style for the skin very very clean like the silver the gold really awesome and it does have that secondary style that you could take the um whole helmet i mean the mask off pretty cool there and page 11 all right so we do have the copy lane i believe this is the first icon series outfit to ever appear inside of a battle pass which is pretty cool uh we have had a icon series emote but not a skin so that's pretty cool so we have uh, the copy lane uh, spray i mean spray uh loading screen and we do have a spray king steel not bad 100 v bucks silent striker uh silent slicer sorry pretty clean there i actually really like that one the nice rainbow touch on it point and shoot all right you're gonna do a little shoot it is not confusing what you do the uh, classic little hands gesture pretty cool there influential a pretty cool icon series wrapping it looks like it has a cell shading or maybe that's just a shading it looks pretty nice 
And then, of course, we have Kabi Lane, uh, Kabi Lane, an icon to his outfit, pretty nice there. I'm guessing he's just gonna, yeah, do the gesture in his idol stance. And in page two, should, yeah, be a style for the skin. So we have traditional Kabi. Um, that is a loading screen, a banner icon, a icon series banner, that's pretty cool. It's like this, an icon series emoticon, it is animated, do you like that one? King's Wings, oh, okay, this is an awesome glider, Are you're hanging on these two things, that is very clean, I like this one, probably my favorite glider actually. And we silent slicer, so this one is an icon series backlink, and I'm guessing it is reactive if you have the harvesting tool equipped as well, if you see the harvesting tool come out the backlink, we've seen it a million times before, however, I think it's really awesome. And 100 V-Bucks and traditional Kabi. Alright, so, ooh, alright, this one does have a cell shading on it. Very unique. Alright, not terrible. And then we have the page 3, Kato Thorn. So this seems to be once in the collector, maybe some sort of villain. I know i um, adding a bunch of different things to its collection over time. So pretty cool loading screen there. Final Eclipse, the whole Eclipse thing, wonder what that's going to be inside this season. And so we're wrapping Reactive as well. Revenant's Haunt, pretty cool spray right there, 100 V-Bucks. Wicked Wings, and Epicontro, not terrible. We've seen very similar ones, however, it's, yeah, not bad. And we Eclipse Edges, once again, not terrible. Don't like this um, specifically, however, maybe the styles might be a little better. And then we have Kato Thorn, a legendary outfit, the tier 100 for the season. Looks pretty clean. We do have a secondary style, which I believe, yeah, you could take off the mask. We did see him with white hair in the trailer, so I'm guessing that's a style of some sort. And then page 14, this is the style for him. So we have Revenant Kato Thorn. This seems to be that bat vampire looking thing. We do have a banner icon. I did, real, um, did see, yeah, in this one, the uh, mask is animated, which is pretty nice. And then we do have Wrath Wings, pretty massive. Um, Bapling right here. I wonder if it's going to be reactive to a, some sort of glider. And if you have both of them equipped, you see the bapling kind of form into the glider, which would be nice. With Vampiric, uh, an uncommon emoticon, not terrible. It is animated. And then 100 V-Bucks, Wrath Wings. All right, so yeah, pretty much what I said. I wonder if there is, once again, that reactivity if you have both of them equipped. You just have to see. Not bear, uh, terrible. And we Metamorphosis. All right, so this is a. All right, so this transforms you between the regular Kato Thorn into whatever they called it, the Revenant Kato Thorn. And yeah, so you get this bone name, I'm guessing, just built into the Kato Thorn outfit. I wonder how this is going to fit in, if this is going to be something for four nightmares. And of course, you will be getting the secondary style just to be that vampire thing um, anytime, which is pretty cool. All right, so that was the 100 items. Not terrible. We do have the bonus reward. So this is um, some different, uh, most of them are different styles. So we have tactical. This is a style for the um, tier one baffling, uh, tier one skins baffling. Oopsie dronesy are for the social shading skin are you in so these are available after claiming all 100 we do have hyperspace pretty cool style right there i do like that one actually more than the original and maze amazing maze all right some type of digital uh maze all right uh masquerade uh tonia all right it reminds me of this other skin that we got i believe it's love thorn or something pretty nice there that pink all right and we do have page two a tactical style for the um i'm guessing it's also tactical um glider and we buff fish this is a new spray right there all right beats a bunny all right this is for the may skin it does have some type of um music on it all right so it reminds me of like some type of fruit ninja just destroying all these little carrots that are coming with bunny sticks all right and we pit master and i'm rapping hyperspace is the style um to that baffling and a lavish uh, kato thorn this is the one that we saw with the white hair all right i'm guessing this also might be a style for the um bat variant um if not it's just uh, at least a style for the kato thorn variant the human one and then we have a bunch of these question marks which are the super styles after t um i believe getting past level 140 you should be able to start unlocking these however we don't even see them before in our 20 days so yeah there's some suspense there we do have the quest rewards so this is these are available after completing um certain weekly quests or at least that's what they were in last season it seems like they did switch it up right here as it says complete six null enchants quests so we maybe have um some type of theme for each of the quests um assigned by different agents i guess you can say from the battle pass and you get sp uh, specific styles to those outfits and items which i think is awesome we do have last resort this is the main key art that we saw when loading in big score of rare control all right we've seen very similar ones however i do like the money flowing out not bad and we've heist formal nolan chance this is probably his best style in my opinion like the gold the white reminds me of wild card um that variant and then we do have these that are coming in 18 days so it seems like 
not all are available makes sense as they are quest rewards and quests come out in weeks um so yeah pretty cool there we do have piping hot and then coming to this is for that one uh pizza delivery skin tit ballers this is is a new glider so it isn't a style so that's pretty nice if hazardous piper pace pretty cool style right there the yellow and green match as well and we have finn addiction so this is a style for that dumbbell and then swirl sailor this it says it's a new glider however i feel like it's just gonna be a different style and we reef cake a fish thick it reminds me of the um skin we have in chapter two see uh, chapter four season four that um gator forgot his name but yeah pretty cool there and we need a banner icon and then dark mode for that harvesting tool for the may um set and we deboot uh dusk may all right pretty cool style right there these are coming 48 days so quite a while and then lastly we do have the ahsoka so it does seem like she is part of the um quote unquote secret skin of the season even though we already know who it is so we have ahsoka tano uh star wars series uh star wars series outfit i wonder if we're ever gonna get the slicer i doubt it i doubt it's gonna be in one of these uh, they actually are are locked which is pretty unique we usually see all of them like the aaron jaeger and last season i already forgot who was last season the meow Souls where we were able to view every single item just not unlock them currently but yeah we are just able to see that it is the ahsoka outfit so yeah pretty cool there all right so the battle pass is a finish that's all of them this was a very solid battle pass i do like some of the skins inside the main battle pass the styles were all right so i'd say like an eight uh, like a nine for sure out of ten and we do have a bunch of quests we'll have to go through these to probably unlock the um different styles and the quest rewards and maybe just different um items in general so yeah that is it for today the next video will be about the gameplay and all that however this was just the battle pass so yeah pretty cool hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to subscribe if you are new because like and hit that bell bye